We're here with Jack of all trades, Don Kelly. Don, talk to me about Rick Porcello. Here's a kid in his early 20s. What is his mood in there? How is he? And what do you expect tonight? Rick, he's real relaxed. I mean, that's just his personality laid back. And, uh, you know, we're just expecting him to go out and do what he does, throw a sinker, uh, get ahead of guys. And he's, he's a good pitcher. Last night, there was a lot of courage shown in this field. Victor Martinez hitting the home run, intercostal. Adrian Beltre with the knee. From a player's perspective, what's going on? Why are guys doing what they're doing? This is a postseason. I mean, Victor's done it all year for us. He sprained his knee in Kansas City. He didn't miss a beat. I mean, he's uh, going to battle, go out there. As long as he's walking, he's going to be in the lineup. And Beltre, too. I mean, that kills when you foul a ball off your knee, foot, chin, whatever it is. Um, and he got himself multiple times. So just the courage that they displayed was, was unreal. Were you surprised today when you learned that both Victor Martinez and Delman Young would be in the lineup? You know, I wasn't really surprised. I mean, those they're two gamers. They want to be out there competing, and uh, especially with everything that's on the line right now, they knew they know that we need them out there. What about the hot foot you had back in July? Talk about that. Justin got me pretty good. It was uh, it was pretty funny, and uh, you know, it was in Minnesota with uh, Bly Levin going into the Hall of Fame. So I don't know if he had that whole thing planned out or what, but it, he got me good. Last thing. Your brother-in-law, not a lot of people know this, is Pirates second baseman Neil Walker. And yet, you met your wife not through Neil, but in some other way. Tell us that roundabout story. Yeah, it was uh, pretty interesting. I played with my oldest brother-in-law, Matt, in double-A in 2003. And my sister and my wife played basketball together in high school. So we ended up meeting later on. They played against each other in college. And I went to watch my sister play and ended up, ended up meeting my wife. Pretty good story there. Now, Yankee Stadium, the home run you hit there. The big one. Talk about that. Uh, you know, it was exciting. I mean, game five, back against the wall, season on the line against the Yankees, and uh, to go out there and be able to help the team out and get on the board early, it was, uh, you know, it's every kid's dream. You said you were floating around the bases. I was. You know, it uh, it was crazy how you, can, you just swing and hit it, and everything just kind of went nuts there for a while. Don, thank you very much. Chris, okay. back to you.